What's up guys, it's Del Matter here and today we're going to be reacting to two different Freedom Tunes videos. Um, first one is why the votes took so long to count and the second one is the FTX scandal explained. Uh, so I wanted to react to both because the, the he's released both these within the last couple days and the one's really short so I didn't want to make a video just specifically on it. But anyway, um, link to both videos down below. Remember to like, comment, subscribe to help the algorithm and uh, yeah, let's just hop right into it I guess. Why do these elections take so long to call? 1,004,836 votes. <laughs> the fucking count down. 1,004,837 votes. Uh, uh, uh. What Elmo wishes it would hurry the f*** up! <laughs> uh. <laughs> red wave, trickle, anything. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there's so many predictions of a red wave. Even It was to the point where even the lefties were predicting a red wave, which is kind of crazy. Um, but I think things have been so politicized, like polarized over the last five, six years that I don't think it's possible. Um, I don't, I don't see how, like, even with the economy and the shambles that it's in now, you didn't have a red wave is kind of indicative of the situation right now, right? How polarized the country is because any other president in history, if they had the economy this bad, they would have been tossed out of office, right? I, I guess, like, well, it's midterms. It's not an actual election, but... Uh, or not a, not a presidential election, but they, they would have 100%, like, got sloshed in the fucking midterms. Like, it's pretty crazy that he was able to pull off what he did. Ah, now I have to start all over. One vote. Ah, ah. <laughs> Two votes. Brought to you by the letter M for mail-in ballots. Yeah. Yeah, one of the things that's funny is uh, if you look at like the number of votes from mail-in ballots versus number of total votes, um, the amount that has dropped from people not going to the polls versus the amount it's raised from people going to mail-in ballots is actually there's a lot of people that really just would not have voted um, had mail-in ballots not be a thing, which is kind of crazy, right? Like these people that aren't even li like they're not, literally not willing to leave their house to vote, but now they can from home um it's kind of questionable uh but anyway the next one we got is the ftx scandal explained so for anyone not familiar with this uh it's basically a scandal in crypto uh, another one um and this guy ran this kind of crypto firm slash bank slash uh trade agency it's really kind of difficult to explain exactly what they do they do a bunch of different stuff um Turns out he was giving money to the Democrats, uh, and also he was taking the money and reinvesting it, like all this different stuff. There was so much stuff going on. Uh, he's under like a bunch of investigations right now, and uh, yeah, it's pretty crazy. Crazy. Um, FTX founder reveals ties with Ukraine government and individuals. I mean, that's not surprising. We need more money for the war effort. The Zelensky man, four twenty. That's fucking hilarious. Sub to Twitch. Subscrabble. Subscribble. <laughs> Following brows. Shang uh, recommended channel. Shangus Freedom Tunes. I wonder if he actually has a Twitch channel. He should start one. Uh, which, by the way, sub to my or I guess follow my Twitch. If you're uh, watching this, then follow my YouTube. Subscribe to my YouTube. Follow my Twitch. <laughs> um, if your country has time to watch Ukraine in the news, you have ten dollars. Truly. If you don't have that, you don't have time to watch Ukraine. Because you should be working. You should be trying to earn money. Uh, no, it's not a ton. It's not a ton of money. I mean, he, to be fair, he actually kind of has a point there. Um, if you don't have ten dollars to donate, you should probably be fucking doing work in some way or another. Uh... But that being said, if you don't want to donate, then that's up to you. But if you don't have the money to donate, then you should be working. <laughs> so, I mean, fair enough. Fair point. We're going to deliver critical support to Ukraine. So being like, I'm broke, I can't afford to sub, that doesn't really track. Oh, thank you so much. We have a donation. Five dollars from Bill. Thank you. Come on, man. I will buy some FTX, my favorite crypto. <laughs> What you mean to say is I'm so irresponsible with my money that I can't sub- Oh, another donation. This one is from George. He sent ten dollars. Come on, man. Gonna buy some more FTX with that. Uh, uh, for the war, uh. of course. 
a donation from John for fifty dollars. <laughs> Thank you, Ron, for seventy-five thousand dollars. Oh God, <laughs> what did Biden say that time? Say, Truder Dash uh, Baba Pressure. What? T ruined or Dash. I'm not sure what that's supposed to say. This is just a bunch of fucking gibberish. Come on, man. Is it a Joe Biden quote? That might honestly be a Joe Biden quote. And Jake just sent 12 million. Come on, man. Oh, wow, a billion from Carl. Come on, man. Out of a billion, 400 million, excuse me, a trillion, 400 billion dollars. It's hard to even say it so much. Joe. Fuck my mom. You said billions to Zelensky. What were you thinking? Folks, I'm going. <laughs> is, is this the man who's been taking advantage of my mentally disabled ward? You are going to find a way to return that money immediately! Or what? <laughs> yeah, if only. <laughs> I love how she calls him a mentally disabled ward. It's kind of true. Oh, you want to find out? <laughs> It's not demonic enough. Her cackle is so much more demonic. Uh, FDX Sam Bankman freed uh, was Democrat's second biggest donor. Yep, true. Yeah, with money that he fraudulently took from customers and is now under a bunch of investigations for. Not sure anything will come of it, though, because you've seen the politicization of the FBI over the past couple years. And, uh... I mean, yeah, they, I, I just, I have no hope for them, to be honest. Like, it's it's pretty ridiculous. I'm sure he'll walk away scot-free. I wouldn't be surprised at all if he walked away scot-free, just because how politicized the FBI has become and the fact that he donated to them and was their second largest donor. If he walks away, I would not be surprised in the least, unfortunately. But anyway, <clears throat> good videos. Let me know what you think below. Like, comment, subscribe, and uh, I'll see you in the next one.